Hello. Um, today I was going through a box with a bunch of old photos, magazines, programs, etc. Um, so I grabbed a pile of old photos out of the box and thought I'd show show you some of my old photos. Most of them are type 1. There might be a few that aren't, but type 1 photo is a photo that was developed from the original negative within two years of the photo being taken. Type 2 is anything after two years that was developed from the original negative. Then you get into type 3, which was not from the original photo or negative. It's from the second generation negative within two years. And then you get into the type 4, which is the second generation photo from the second generation negative after two years. So now that I've totally confused everybody with that definition, um, let's look at some photos. First I have uh, this great photo from about 1954. I've shown this on a short before. This is Roy and Ray Mantle, Mickey Mantle's twin brothers. And this is a first generation photo. It's got the stamp on the side number stamped on the side you can tell that it came from the original negative next one I have is another Yankee Elston Howard I, I just love these photos you don't see this kind of a pose on any cards of Elston Howard's and these are stamped from the Pan American Photo Company in Bronx New York I have several of these. I've got a Jim Boughton. Stadium in the background there. That's also stamped. Here's a Bobby Richardson. And that's also from Pan American. Photography. And the last Pan American one I have is uh, Mel Stottlemyre. Here's one of Jackie Jensen. And that one appears like it could be, but there's no way to tell for sure. This has an old tape mark on the back. No stamping, no marking. Same with the Gil McDougall. I'm assuming these are from spring training, these last two. A lot of these Yankee photos I uh, purchased from Cracker Jack cards and his dad. They are very, very generous. They, they bought a big collection and just had some awesome stuff. Um, check out their videos. Um, you can see the awesomeness of the collection that they bought. Okay, here's the interesting photo. It's Mickey Mantle. Reverse negative photo. This is a type 1. I'm thinking of t sending this to PSA and getting it authenticated as type 1. You can see there's a number on the back. From the original printing of it. I'm going to go along with this. Here's one that's not a reverse negative. It's Mickey Mantle again. Same photo, only it's not reverse negative. Not reverse like this one, so it almost looks like you got Mickey batting right, Mickey batting left. The one is a reverse of the negative. Here's one I have of Satchel Page. Nice picture of him with Cleveland. And this is after his playing days. It may not be a type one just because of the back. It looks like it 
to copy. Here's a pretty cool one, I think. 1959, Bill Russell in action against the New York Knicks. And that one's a stamped Associated Press on the back. Here's another fun one. Connie Mack, Santa Claus, happy birthday. I believe it was the 78th birthday. And that has the paper taped to the back along with the stamp behind the paper. And this is a movie still photo, Satchel Page, Robert Mitchum from the movie The Wonderful Country from 1959. I watched the movie, Satchel had a few lines. Um, nothing sensational, but he was in the movie. It's probably an hour or so into the movie before you see him. And here's, these are not type one, these are Manny's Baseball Land. This is Bob Feller. Manny's was a store next, or well, across the street from Yankee Stadium back in the day. I, I remember going to Yankee Stadium, but I don't remember what the store names were that I went to across the street. But it, it was a good time, it was the old stadium. Here's a 1949-50 Omaha Knights. Why is this one important? This guy here is in the Hockey Hall of Fame, Marcel Pronovo. Omaha was all, also where Gordy Howe and Terry Sawchuk played minor league hockey before they went into the NHL and led to their storied careers, NHL Hall of Fame. And what I have next is 1951 boxing photo. That's uh, Sugar Ray Robinson that's cringing on the side there. It's from a championship fight. I mean, if I could just collect photos if I, you know, but there's so much other wonderful memorabilia out there. This one's stamped, United Press. These are just things that don't exist today they're fun when you find them and here's big George Mikan 1950s Minneapolis Lakers with his famous glasses he's got old number 99 on that jersey there this one isn't stamped so there's not definite proof that it's type 1 it does have pinholes which tend to age them, but still can't age it to being a type 1 for sure, so they'd probably classify it type 2. But I'd like to thank everybody for watching, and I hope you enjoyed looking at some old photos with me. Everybody have a great time tonight. Thank you.